Plant expansion complete. What's going on, y'all? It's Doss, and I'm ready to open up a big fat can of whoop ass right here. Metal Gear Solid 5, The Phantom Pain. We are back. And the last time we left off, we, uh. We got a hell of a blow dealt to us as far as what we thought was happening in this game. We took care of the Huey Emmerich trial. We also took care of having the truth revealed to us. Mission number 46, The Man Who Sold the World. And then, finally, we lost our girl Quiet. So, it's, uh, it's been hard. It's been heavy, man. And I really, I played that last mission, that last series of missions. And it was kind of difficult to, to get through. I got through it all in one go. But after I was done recording it, it, it really took a toll on me mentally and emotionally and shit in a way games really haven't taken a toll on me mentally and emotionally in a long time I recorded it all in one playthrough it just took a lot of time for me to upload it properly so let's check and see what I got going on right here a lot of things changed since I last played this game And now we'll see exactly what we need as far as base facilities are concerned. Let me just take a quick look at how much mother base coins I need to build another FOB. Because I know I got a whole lot of mother base coins just logging in today. But like I was trying to say before, that last series of events really kind of just took a toll on me. So let me just check something real quick. I'm pretty certain Please that I mission. completed the game. I feel like there are no extra main ops. And we're in a situation, kind of like the Peace Walker walkthrough, where we're done with the main story mode, but there are a whole lot of extra ops or rather, there are a whole lot of side ops and there are a whole lot of main ops that are repeats of main ops that I have already done with special modifications. I'm kind of in the same position here with this walkthrough that I was in the Peace Walker walkthrough where I have to complete a whole lot of extra ops, extra main ops, extra side ops, whatever you want to call it. So that will come in due time. I, I labeled the last video that I uploaded, what was it, two days ago. I, I labeled it the ending because it was the ending of the story mode, but we are far from done with this game. We got a whole lot of things to take care of. Let's see if we can claim some of these challenge task rewards right here. We got a whole lot of GMP. We got some soldiers, highly ranked soldiers. Now we're sitting on a, a decent bit of GMP. So we got a bunch of side ops and main ops right here to tackle. Let's just take a look. Let's just take a look at the side ops that we have to take care of. Please select a landing zone. Heading to Central Africa. Now, when I was thinking about this and the period of time that I wasn't playing this game in the two weeks while I was deciding if I even wanted to continue uploading this shit. Wow. Unfucking believable, man. It's, it's crazy. But in the time I was thinking about this game when I wasn't really playing it, I, I kind of. I don't know, man. Playing as Punish Snake really kind of seems... It really just seems like a, a reminder of just the, the craziness in this game. 
on the feeling of almost betrayal that I experienced playing this game. So we're going to switch it out right here. I'm looking for my girl Silent Wallaby. Oh, and there she goes. And we're going to use Silent Wallaby from here on out. Until I, at least I figure out my real feelings about Punish Snake. I, I, right now, I, he just feels like a reminder of something, of a twist that I really just didn't like. So we're going to go with a girl, Silent Wallaby. And we're going to be joined by our boy, D-Dog. We don't have a girl quiet anymore, unfortunately, but it is what it is. We're going to bring our boy D-Dog in right here. And he's gonna help us do the damn thing. We're looking good on our loadout. Let's get this bad boy started. Deploying. Alright, so let's get this bad boy underway and we're gonna complete this mission. And I'm definitely gonna need my boy D-Dog's support on this one. It's gonna be a shame because I love rolling with my girl quiet, but it uh it is what it is, quite honestly. Got the girl Silent Wallaby. She will be doing the thing in in turn of the boss, or I guess he is still big boss. In the matter of speaking, actually, I don't I don't believe that Punish Snake is big boss because the big boss title was a title given to Naked Snake for killing the boss. You can't just pass that off. You can't just pass that meme of big boss onto somebody else so that the so that they can take the fucking fall for you Extraction while you go off and hide in the fucking background to build your heaven. I've been thinking this entire time and like the ending really doesn't make too much sense to me. I said this when I first beat the mission that the actions that Big Boss did really don't match the Big Boss that I know. I knew he's supposed to fall into a villainous character, but maybe, maybe that's, maybe that's what makes him a fucking villain. But no one really explained how he became that way. He just woke up out of the coma and said, I'm just going to be a piece of shit and abandon everybody. But that's not the big boss that I know. Let me just take care of this punk ass suckers real quick. That's the target. Take your nap real quick, you punk ass sucker. Don't you... Don't you come stumbling towards me like you ain't got no damn sense. Let me see if you got some skills. Let me see if you suckers got some skills. That's, oh, you ain't got no goddamn skills. You gonna take this motherfucking permanent nap. I'll kidnap your bitch ass, that A++. Eh, I'll take it. I'll take that A++, whatever. Got a guy right on the outside of this little wall right here. Let's see if he's got them skills that pay the bills. Another A++. We'll give him a little nap. We're gonna give him a motherfucking ride back to Mother Base. We're gonna kidnap this bitch ass. Oh, y'all thought y'all heard something, huh? Y'all thought y'all heard something, huh? Y'all ain't hear nothing. Take, oh, you boy, you got a helmet on? Roll up He's on your too. punk ass. Roger give you that. a little quick CQC. Ass. What happened to your helmet, bitch? Oh, you thought you heard something happen, huh? The boy had a little exclamation point and above his head, like, did I just get my ass beat? Yes, you did, punk. Boy out here on the outside snitching and shit. Let me show you what it is that happens to suckers that start tattletale and calling CP like I ain't gonna come out there and whoop that ass. 
How dare you roll up into my motherfucking spot? You piece of trash. Damn, what the hell is that? All that goddamn dust. Somebody needs to call a goddamn maid to clean this dirty mother. What? What is this boy doing? You just gonna roll up in here like you motherfucking gangbusters? You ain't LAPD, motherfucker. Take your nap. You don't even knock. You run up into the motherfucking room. This ain't your mansion, but this is your ass whooping. Get choked out, sucker. Take your nap. Let's see if you got some skills. You ain't got no goddamn skills to be running up in here. You A plus. Get your Whack motherfucker, you disrespectful motherfucker. Let me see if your buddy got some skills. Oh, you got, you got some skills. A plus plus, A plus plus. I'll steal your bitch ass. And I'm with Didi. Cause that boy got my motherfucking back. Cause he's the only one that got my back. Didi, you better not leave me, baby. You better not give no motherfucking parasites and desert me. Cause I don't know if I can handle that. I'm glad they ain't do shit to Didi in this motherfucking game. I just, I just said fuck this game permanently. Looks like we got a sucker behind me. You thought you saw some, huh? Let's see if you got some skills. Oh, you a lion, some of a bitch. You a lion, some of a bitch. But you gonna get this medal after I kidnap your bitch ass. So let me get the kidnapping. Looks like we got three more guys up in this room. Oh, I forgot this guy right here. This A plus one. I was about to kidnap him before, but I don't. This motherfucker, that A plus ain't impressing nobody though. The A plus ain't impressing nobody though. Analysis. Like I just said, the A plus. Oh, get back your happy ass up, you motherfucker! You unimpressive A plus punk ass bitch! Get toe up. Run up on. Don't don't you ever in your dirty ass life run up on Silent Wallaby. We got two more suckers left. Analysis. Uh oh, this boy ain't got shit. You ain't shit. Dirty. This motherfucker was at B rank. Sit your bum ass down. B rank, bum rank. Let me see if you got some motherfucking skills, punk and stuff. Analysis. This boy talking to the wall and shit. You saw him shaking his head. Take your motherfucking that crazy ass bastard. <laughs> this boy was fucking talking. What am I doing? Get the fuck off the. Silent Wallaby's on drugs. She hiding out in this funky ass, dusty ass mansion. With all this dust and these crazy motherfuckers all around. Let me get the hell up out of here. God damn, get my motherfucking GMP and all the crazy suckers that I kidnapped. And we gotta get the hell up out of here. Good God. These boys are getting their service crosses. That will increase their basic parameters. They'll give them some increases in some of their, uh, not unit functions, but some of their abilities. Let me just take a quick look at uh, some of the nearby side ops. Maybe I can quick travel and take care of something else right here, but none of these side ops oh we got one in the band pv plantation there's another wandering puppets mission i can quick travel there and take care of that so let's go uh let's go quick travel i know we got a quick travel point in the back of this mansion area we passed it on the way in and we can quick travel i think i unlocked the band pv plantation i think we can quick travel there and then take care of this next side up if worse comes to worse and i didn't unlock the band pv plantation I got such a shitty memory, I really can't remember if I did or didn't. But if I didn't, I'll just call in the chopper. And then there, that way. But I'm pretty sure I did. I can't remember which part I did, but I remember... I'm lying, I don't remember shit. I'm gonna... I can't remember what the fuck I ate for breakfast. Hopefully, I unlock this goddamn... What you call it? Delivery point, quick travel point. So let's steal these last couple of vehicles and get the hell up out of here. Take care of this next side up. These wandering puppets missions are pretty good because they reward you with a whole lot of GMP for very easy missions. Please select a delivery point. Alright, so let's get this one taken care of. Steal this little jeep real quick. I don't know how many vehicles it takes for me to reach the maximum, but I'm gonna try to take as many vehicles as I possibly can. 
Let's see if you got some skills, sucker. Analysis. You use a lion, some of a bitch, but you gonna level right up when I give you that cross. So get your ass kidnapped. Subject on board. Leave the rest to us. This boy hanging out in this little hut by himself. I bet you ain't got no goddamn skills. He ain't got no goddamn skills. You bum. You sucker. Take your nap. I can see why you was all by yourself. Nobody likes you. You bum. <laughs> you bum ass motherfucker. His balls probably stank too. Take a shower, you dead bitch. Oh, who's this guy running up? Who's this guy? You got some skills? You running up? Oh, he thinks he's a tough guy. He's trying to get himself some. Damn, motherfucker, stop bobbing your little punk ass head. Stop bobbing. I'm about to kill you. Stop bobbing. Who you gonna get shot up? Yeah, you better. Oh, who you swinging at? Let me see if you got some skills to be swinging at somebody. Oh, you gonna level right up after I kidnap your bitch ass. You might got some skills. Use a disrespectful son of a bitch for swinging at your girl's side of all of me. But you will take that little kidnapping. I guarantee you that one. We got some decent guys coming in right here off this Wandering Puppets mission. Some of these guys are boasters and liars, but once they get these surface crossed, that will increase their parameters. So, I think we should be good, even though these motherfuckers are lying. Trying to take care of all these damn decoys and take all these damn resources and all these damn emplacements doing everything I can to level up my base because even though we're done with the game we're still not done because I have to I have to build up my FOB and protect it I've really been at a situation where I haven't been playing the game and when I logged on I expected my FOB to be fucked by a bunch of assholes stealing my shit but I don't know if it's a situation where my FOB is so low level no one wants to even come in because it's not worth it or the people that are at my level because I'm pretty sure that you infiltrate the FOBs look look at this happy motherfucker you big armored biatch you gonna run at somebody I ain't your motherfucking mama I ain't your motherfucking prostitute girlfriend don't run at me you ugly son of a bitch all these guys got armors and shit on let me see if you guys got some skills oh he's a goddamn surgeon stop running at me you gonna slap did you slap DD I know your ass ain't do that you're flipped Cause if you hit Didi, you're gonna get fucked up in a way you can't even motherfucking fathom. Don't do that to yourself. Just get kidnapped. Enjoy the ride, you bitch. But like I was trying to say before, I'm not even sure that my FOB... Oh, you ain't got no skills! Get toe up! Get toe up! Get toe up! Oh, that one is pretty good, huh, bitch? No, it ain't! Get toe up! Get toe... You're dead, bitch. You're dead. Just get toe up. But I'm not sure if my FOB is just a shitty FOB that no one wants to infiltrate or that the people that are at my level just, I guess they're not playing the game anymore because truth be told, it took a while for me to finish the game. I've been able to just stay off Analysis the internet complete. for the entirety Analysis while I was trying complete. to figure out when I was going to get some goddamn time to finish this game. But I've just been staying off the internet and that's how I've been able to complete the game without getting spoiled. But I'm pretty sure everybody else has completed the game months ago, and they might have moved on to something else. So I guess that's pretty much why the lower level people just not attacking my shit. In any case, I'm still trying to build up my FOB so that nobody else, a higher level, lower level, whatever the case may be, attacks my shit. And if they do, they're gonna be sorry. So that's the completed mission. Alright, so that's two side ops completed. Two very well paying as far as GMP is concerned. Side ops, right? Here. Let me just check and see if there's any other side ops I can quick travel to. I can quick travel to this mine clearer mission by the Mafinda oil field and possibly take care of that. So I think that's going to be the strategy right here. That might be the last thing I can quick travel to, so. I'm going to quick travel over there, take care of the mine clearing missions, because that's a strand of side ops that I really haven't done too many of, so we'll take care of those right here, right now. Silent Wallaby is doing her goddamn thing, baby. 
doing it just like it should be done. Whooping ass, taking suckers out, and getting objectives, and getting money for the mother face. But like I was trying to say way before, I'm going to be playing a Silent Wallaby until I at least get out of my feelings about Big Boss and, and Punish Snake. Because, yeah, you know, I'm, I'm a little salty about how Big Boss did Diamond Dogs and MSF. I, I didn't really appreciate the Like, I thought of Big Boss the same way that the MSF soldiers thought of Big Boss. Come here, you little motherfucker. I ain't getting that motherfucker. Fuck him. I was gonna give you a little ride back to Mother Base so you can hide my zoo, but fuck you, little bitch ass bird. Please select a delivery point. Alright, so I see my way back to Mother Base. There's a side op in the Datati, well, not in the Datati nearby village. It's one by the Kukenga Mine. The rest of the side ops in the Africa area, they're kinda nearby outposts, but I just can't quick travel straight to the outpost and then get straight into a side op. So I think I can just do these right here. Do the, the mind clearing mission and then extract back the mother base on top of one of these materials containers. I think that's gonna be the plan right here. We'll just clear this, then I'll head back to the AC. Fuck you, you nosy some bitch. You ain't seen nothing. How's your motherfucking kneecaps? Not too good, huh? Not too goddamn good, huh? Analysis complete. This boy got some decent skills, even though he's too damn nosy for his own good. Maybe his nosiness will come in handy for the unit. Hopefully. He's coming too. Roger that. Get this punk ass sucker hiding behind this barricade. I ain't gonna roll around and bust him in the top of his damn head. Analysis complete. Take your nap, sucker. Got some skills, I'll kidnap you. Let's see if this boy has some skills. Complete. Oh, you're a lion, some bitch, though. That S rank had me excited a little bit. Silent Wallaby, get down! This girl's losing her mind. For a second, I thought about tearing that dude up, but uh, we'll leave him there for now. We'll just be stealing some materials, so we'll be stealing some emplacements. Analysis complete. Analysis complete. Nosy motherfuckers! <laughs> Don't peek at me. Don't peek at Silent Wallaby, you ugly ass bastards. Alright, so the mine clearing side op is what I came over here to take care of, and that's not too far off. So we'll be able to take care of that and then head back into the Infinda oil field to extract there. Now that we've thinned out the area. Like I was trying to say before, I uh I don't appreciate what Big Boss did to his comrade, especially fucking Kaz, who I thought playing through Peace Walker. <laughs> playing through Peace Walker, you get the feeling that the only two people that Big Boss and Kaz trust are each other. And the fact that he just left Kaz and let him kind of take the fall along with one of his best soldiers and punish Snake. I, that's just like a treacherous fucking thing for Big Market Boss to do. And Market it went exactly Market against Market what he Market claims Market to be fighting Market for. And that's a place where soldiers don't get used as tools of government. And that's his goal. That's his 
dream out of heaven, but he just fucking does it to establish it. But in order to establish out of heaven, he becomes a hypocrite and starts using his own soldiers as tools for his own goddamn goals. So I don't know, man. I'm really up in my feelings about what Big Boss did during this game. And I'm really, I don't know how I feel about Punish Snake. There's a lot of respect that I got for Punish Snake for what he went through in this game and the skills and the fucking loyalty that he has. Even after he realized what he was, what he was to Big Boss, how he was used. That would have fucking sent me way over the edge as a soldier. And I'd said this before, I kind of think in this game, and the reaction I had to the truth ending, I kind of think of everything that's been happening in this game. I kind of think about everything from the, like the viewpoint of an MSF soldier, but... Oh, this boy got some skills. Take your nap. Damn, I miss. This motherfucker to my right scared the shit out of me. Stop moving your head, bitch. Don't make me blow your motherfucking brains out. But like I was trying to say, I kind of think of things as an MSF soldier. I kind of feel betrayed and a little enraged by Big Boss's actions, but Punish Snake, he just kind of takes too. things. Roger that. He just kind of takes things. He just doesn't even get rage. Oh my god, what are you- Stop running up! Stop running up! Get toe up! I was gonna try to trank him, then he was moving on me too close. I tried to throw a stun grenade. Motherfucker just rolled up on me. Like, I ain't prepared to tear his motherfucking world apart. I'm shooting anchors. I'm shooting kneecaps. Let me see if I got some skills. Tearing up these boys' kneecaps. See if these boys got some skills before I finish them off. Oh, I know this motherfucker ain't gonna try to tear me up on his ass. Uh-oh. Who you peeking at, you son of a bitch? Get shot up. Get shot up. Subject on board. Leave the rest to us. Analysis complete. Make sure this boy ain't getting too happy. We got maybe two or three more guys in this outpost before it's clear, but I think I should be able to extract here without too many troubles. But like I was trying to say before, I got a lot of respect for Punish Snake because he just he took all the punishment. And while I didn't, I definitely did not agree with his decision not to get revenge on Yamari. He he just he just kind of let it go. He really I don't think Punish Snake was really concerned with revenge so much as he was concerned with Analysis the safety complete. of his comrades. And this motherfucker with this A plus is two, two bumps at us be running up on me like that. So sit your whack ass down real quick. I got a lot of respect for Punish Snake. There's no hatred from me for Punish Snake. And there's definitely a bit of respect for what he went through in this game, but it's just what he represents as the... He's just a fucking symbol of the lie that this game was. And the lie that Big Boss told me. And that big boss told the entire world and that he's continuing to tell the whole world so I don't think I'm gonna be playing as as Punish Snake for too much longer I'm gonna be rocking out with my girl Silent Wallaby and we're gonna be getting the job done like that Extraction arrived at Mother Base
side ops list updated. All right, so we got some new side ops coming in right here. But there's one thing that I wanted to do. I just saw some guys coming. We got some new volunteers, and it's been a while since I've really kind of gone over this. I need to do some staff management, because I've seen that we've gotten a couple of volunteers after each of the missions that I've done, and I wasn't really concentrating on the management aspect of my diamond dog. So let's go through this right here and see if we've got some motherfuckers who are no good. But first, we're going to hand out some contracts. I remember after the truth revelation mission we got some guys coming in right here with some double s plus plus ranks a girl glacier a mongoose she got some goddamn skills creeping buzzard she's got some goddamn skills hold that contract the blue salamander he's got some skills hold that contract howling platypus you got some skills hold that contract that boy's so fucking bald headed <laughs> fucking raise the hedgehog why, why the most <laughs> why the most skilled dudes in my combat unit so fucking bald headed but also, let's take care of some of these guys that might have the troublemaker skill. Because like I say, it doesn't matter who you are in my goddamn unit. If you got that troublemaker skill, I don't care how skilled you are, you got to G.O. You got to, got to, get to, got to, get the hell out. You ain't got to go home, but you got to get the hell up out of here. So we got a couple of troublemakers. This guy is violent. This guy is on fucking sanitary. Ashton Stallion's also on sanitary, but he was one of the... He's one of the unique characters in that mission to save the General's number two. He is the General's number two from that mission with the Child Soldier. So I think that's the reason why he's got that contract. So I think he'll stay for now until I feel like fuck this nigga Select and I'll get rid of him. But for right now, these two troublemakers, they gotta go. And we're looking good on this front. So another thing I want to do, we're sitting on 2.1 million. GMP. So let's get some development started right here. We got a whole lot of weapons and items that probably Please are ready for development project. with all this GMP that I have. So let's see what I really need. We got that Riot SMG, but my my FOB is lethal, so I don't think I'll be using that. We do have this Karabaga that my security team could use, so let's get that developed. And we still got a decent amount of GMP goddamn leather jacket. I mean, it's only 10 G's. Guess we can get that started with development. Don't know if I'm going to be wearing this shit, but we also got the infinity bandana. It's a 1 million GMP. That's a whole lot, but I got it for right now. Let's get that developed. As well as the Gray Fox Cyborg Ninja uniform. Improved sprinting speed, huh? I guess I'll take it. And just like that, all my GMP is gone. Spent it all on uniforms, couple of weapon developments, and uh, I guess we're done for right now. Alright, so we did take care of a couple of side ops as far as the wandering puppet soldiers and the mind clearing missions, but there's also been a Skulls FOB event. And this is my intruder's log. Like I said before, I feel like my FOB is such a low level, it's only a C. That not many people are coming after it. And yeah, I can just look at my infiltration targets, PFs of equal grade. You do infiltrate people at an equal level of you. And a lot of these guys don't even infiltrate. So a lot of guys at my level are not doing the FOB stuff. So I really don't... I guess I don't have to worry about people at this level really fucking with my shit. But it's still good to build up my FOB for when I do increase in level. Alright, so we got some rewards right here. These are the points that I need to get this shit. I'm probably going to concentrate again on the unique rewards. The staff is not much of a concern, but if I got some extra points, I'll take care of it. Let's get this bad boy started. Heading to FOB. Alright, so we've done the FOB event, the Skulls event already, so the thing that I need the most, the weapon that's really good against the Skulls, is this Serval AMR sniper rifle. All the rest of this stuff is decent, because I can use the shotgun and the pistol to neutralize the guards and extract them, because those are two extra objectives. I also need to keep all of my items, weapons, 
and equipment under grade level 5, so we're good on the secondary support and the items. We also need to change out of the sneaking suit and into a combat uniform. So we'll go with the Tiger Stripe. Actually, you know what? Let's go with the let's go with the bubblegum camo. Maybe not. Let's not uh you know what? Let's just go with the um let's go with the olive drive. Alright. I thought about the bubblegum camo, but Sound Wallaby doesn't roll like that. She rolls in the olive drive. Let's get this bad boy started. So one of the objectives is to extract an emplacement. Yeah, it's the it's the anti-aircraft emplacement. Anyway, I still need these emplacements for defenses around my FOB and on top of Mother Base. So we will still, damn it, <laughs> get out of the goddamn emplacement, Wallaby. We will steal all of these that we possibly can. We also need to extract guys and neutralize these funky ass skulls. Who you peeking at, sucker? <laughs> Hold that shotgun, you bitch! A motherfucker head bounce off the wall and shit. Don't peek at me, you slut. Sit your ass back down. Get kidnapped. We also need to get rid of the skulls within 300 seconds, also known as five minutes. Oh shit! Damn, they came way before I was ready for them. Hold that! Hold that! Stop peeking at me, you punk ass sucker. Where you teleported to? I hear them tearing up, but where the fuck are they? I only really see the goddamn stumbly. No, these are. <laughs> I only see the goddamn stumbling puppet soldiers. Where the fuck did the skulls go? I can kidnap these dudes later. That'll help me complete that extraction objective. Damn, there's only the puppet soldiers around me. Where the fuck did the skulls are? Where the fuck did the skulls go? I can hear them all around me. Teleporting and shooting and shit. Where are they at? That's not even him. Oh, here he goes, here he goes, here he goes. Looking for me, you bitch? God damn, I missed! Oh no, not that fucking attack. Not that underground bullshit. I'll blow your goddamn balls off. You act like I want to shoot this underground fake ass on the wall and shit. Here he comes. Fuck that attack. Fuck that attack. Fuck your wall. Oh! God damn! Motherfucker teleported right in front of me and slapped the shit out of me with a machete. No bueno. Look at the fucking scar I got in my mouth. He motherfucker. He motherfucker chopped my cheeks off with that one. You no good son of a bitch. Get your health back, Wallaby. No bueno. Oh damn, I was just about to fucking. I was just about to extract my goddamn neutralized targets. This motherfuckers blew him up with that goddamn underground attack. Come on, I'm gonna take your bitch ass down. Get that bitch. Damn, he just blew these two guys I had tranquilized off the goddamn FOB. Oh, you are a hoe for that one. You a hoe for that one with that goddamn armor. Die, you slut. Fuck you and your armor. Who's just come around the corner? Get your happy ass. Take your nap. Get some of this sniper rifle all up in your motherfucking dang lane. Oh, you piece of shit! You piece of shit puppet bitch! God damn! The motherfucker tried to grab my silent wallaby titties, and this motherfucker just came out the sky with a goddamn flying machete attack. Piece of shit. You piece of shit. Die, you hoe. Alright, we got one more skull left. 
Oh, fuck you! With that underground shit. We got one more skull left. And 50 seconds to take him out. Is, he, this, is this motherfucker shooting me through the goddamn FOB? What the fuck? Alright, so that was the extraction objective. No, no! Oh, God, fuck you! Fuck you! Oh! Fuck you! Fuck you, nigga! Fuck you, nigga! This motherfucker goddamn teleported on me twice. He slapped the shit on me with the machete. That's the third time. That shit almost fucking killed me. Then he jumped up into the air, but he got that CQC counter, and he got fucked up. Selling motherfucking wallaby doing the motherfucking thing, baby. Give me all my motherfucking objectives, Nyogo. Extraction arrived at Mother Base. My girl, Sandler Wallaby, is wearing the wounds of war. She got sliced up, what was it, three times? In that bitch-ass FOB event by them punk-ass skulls? But that's a motherfucking warrior you're looking at, ladies and gentlemen. Took them shits like a motherfucking champion. You gonna slap me? I ain't your motherfucking mama. Don't you fucking slap me. So we definitely got some reward points after that one. We got all the objectives. We're sitting on 24,000 points. So, we will claim some of these rewards. I'm going to go with the uniform, and I think I can afford all of the weapon colors. And maybe within one more infiltration, if I can get all the objectives complete, I'll be able to afford the base color and the emblem part. Damn shit, I'm not going to use that shit, because fuck it, liquid. But, uh, if I do have some extra event points, I might be able to get some extra staff coming in right here. But we are sitting on some more GMP after coming out of that successful infiltration on that FOB. So let's get some more development going on right here. It's that new uniform, the Solemn uniform. We'll get that developed. We got some cardboard boxes. I'm not sure if I'm going to be using these, but let's just get them out of the development tab while we got some GMP. Let's just take care of all this stuff right here right now. We'll also develop the flare supplies. And we'll get rid of these shields as well. Alright, so we can't develop anything else. We're still sitting on a decent amount of GMP. And let's just take a look at what we needed for base facilities. Maybe I should have got this constructed first. We needed two million to construct that FOB platform. And we needed biological materials and common metals to construct this platform in addition to the GMP. So I don't think I would have been able to get platform constructed underway or started regardless of how much GMP I had before I spent it all. But maybe we'll get some more GMP and some more resources after we finish this next infiltration. I don't know if I want to do an infiltration immediately though. Let's take a look at our side ops and see what we have available. Do I want to end this part off with some side ops or do I want to do another FOB infiltration to end it off? So we got a couple of side ops. We got prisoner extractions. We got highly skilled soldiers, wandering puppet soldier missions. I think I might end it here in OKB0. We can end with this side up. That's a decent payout. So we're going to do this FOB infiltration and then we're going to finish it off with the side up.
Heading to FOB. Alright, so we'll take all our highest upgraded weapons. And one thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna change Silent Wallaby out of this goddamn Olive Drab uniform. I see that we have other combat uniforms. Some of them are higher grade than others. We got some level 2 and level 3 combat uniforms. But I don't know if any of these higher level combat uniforms allow her to absorb extra damage. Because I almost died a couple of times in that last infiltration. I don't know. Do any of these allow me to take extra damage? I know they have other effects as far as helping you blend in and get you noticed less, but as far as damage resistance is concerned, I don't know. So let's go with the animal's uniform. Can't go with the naked option, but we're going to go with the animal uniform. And let's get this bad boy started. Deploying. Alright, so this infiltration is going to be a little bit more difficult because we only have, just like the last one, we only have five minutes to get the job, well, this infiltration complete. Oh, you little sucker, you was hiding down here, huh? So I'm going to infiltrate. So you took a motherfucking trank bullet right to your motherfucking head, so you're getting kidnapped. Did you see all of that, you punk bitch? Get yourself some. Let me see if I can get... Oh, no, bueno. Don't get slapped up in the goddamn emplacement, Wallaby. What are you doing, girl? What is this happy motherfucker doing? Put your arms down, you crazy son of a bitch. Get tranked. Get kidnapped. But like I was trying to say, this one's going to be a little bit hard as far as the base development platform is concerned. Because in addition to trying to defeat the skulls, neutralize... All the guards, good god, they all found me. I almost killed this motherfucker in one go. Let me see if I can get some of these materials containers to body him. Oh no, boy, no! Oh! Go run! Don't slap me, you slut! Did that motherfucker hit me in the ass? I got blood coming out my ass off a slap with the mo- What the fuck has this dude got in his hands or in his motherfucking- Why that boy so powerful got me bleeding out the booty hole off a slap? What the fuck? Oh, you're a piece of shit. That boy with that powerful slap is about to get blown the fuck up, though. Ow, ow, motherfucker. Ow, ow, motherfucker! Where's the courtesy? Goddamn! Oh, you're a piece of shit! Ah, oh, you're a piece of shit! Oh, why are you... Oh, God! I gotta use these goddamn containers as cover. I keep extracting my cover here. I'm trying to get these containers, but... These motherfuckers are tearing me up and trying to fuck me up with the underground bullshit. I think I gotta thin the herd with these bum ass skulls. Look at this punk sucker. Watch, wait till I get my goddamn health. I'm gonna come and bust your ass real quick. Hold that. How's your forehead? You got a headache, you bitch? You ain't Michael Jackson. Stop leaning. Start dying. Oh, hold that. Oh, you wanna appear? You can't stop me. Oh, fuck you and that teleporting bullshit. I hate the skull so much. They got all the punkiest attacks. The underground bullshit attack. The armor up fucking defense. The teleport and slap. But they still ain't shit. They still getting fucked up by the girl Silent Wallaby. They still getting their ass beat. Yum yum get yourself some. Yo. Well that thing is about to blow up. I know it's not going to attack me. Let me see if I can get some of these containers out of here. Got just under a minute and a half to get these containers. Fuck you! 
That shit came up out of the ground into my asshole. God damn, you no good son of a bitch. Can I get my motherfucking containers in peace? Let me see if I can line these assholes up. Oh, gotcha, bitches. Gotcha, motherfuckers. You dead. Alright, so we got less than a minute. Let me see if I can get these containers up out of here. I gotta put this motherfucker down because you know he'll try to grab me while this motherfucker flies out of the sky to slap me up with a goddamn machete. Fuck you and your armor. Oh, oh, he is tearing the shit up out of me. Oh, no, you gotta sit your ass back down. I know you too damn happy. Oh, you fuck you with this attack. Fuck you. We got 30 seconds. We gotta move quick. We gotta move quick. Grab these containers. I don't have to worry about extracting them so much, but we gotta get it done. 16 seconds, let's go. You're dead, bitch. Let's go. Three, two, one. Come on, he's dead. What the fuck? It takes a couple of seconds, but let me see if I can get these containers and at the very least I'm loose event points for that infiltrate within 300 seconds objective but we fought him off. I got I think I got most of the containers extraction arrived at mother base Damn, my girl Silent Wallaby took some definite damage in that last one. But uh, we're sitting on a million GMP once again, so let's see if we can get some more development started. We got so many weapons that we we can get started with development on, so let's let's get this finished. Oh damn, that's right. That's right. We gotta wait for the rest of these to finish with the development. Then we can continue to develop new weapons and items. Let me see if I can get some base facilities constructed in the meanwhile then. No, we're still missing either biological material, common metals, or for the command platform, we need more GMP. So for right now, there's nothing really we can do. Let's claim this challenge task award. I'll take these three extra APCs. Another thing I haven't done is sent out any units for combat deployment, so let's set some units up and we'll get them sent out so we can get some extra GMP. In the meanwhile, I haven't been doing that during the course of the Truth and the Quiet missions and all the other stuff. It really distracted me, so we're going to get this Unit started dispatched. again. Unit we got all our units sent out, so we're looking good on this front. Alright, so we had a little technical snafu right there. Like I said before, I wanted to finish with the side up to extract the highly skilled soldier in OKB-0, but I decided to infiltrate behind the central Afghanistan base camp, complete this prisoner extraction, and then move up the path to complete the highly skilled soldier extraction. They'll knock out a few bit of side ops and get a decent amount of GMP. This is a hell of a motherfucking parking job. It's like I already infiltrated and then fucked the shit up, jumped in the helicopter. I ran the fuck back off again, but I promise that's not what happened. It's just a sign of things to come more likely. We'll get out on foot for right here. 
Easy, Didi. There's furry motherfuckers. They know better than the fuck with the girl Silent Wallaby. Enemy and the Diamond Dog. Alright, so like I said, we're infiltrating the Afghanistan base camp. We've done this mission before, and I know exactly where the prisoner is. So this is not necessarily a fuck with the entire base type of situation. This is just a get in, get some materials, maybe some guys with some skills, get the prisoner, get the GMP, and then get out so we can do the side up that I haven't already completed in the OKB0 OK outpost. So that's one sucker taking his nap. We're just gonna keep it low and slow. On some non foolishness side up activity. This motherfucker better not peek because you know I don't know how to act. Don't ruin me, you motherfucker. Don't you ruin me. Oh, you knew it was gonna happen. You knew it was gonna happen. Don't you radio into nobody. Just take your motherfucking nap. Subject on board. Leave the rest to us. Take your motherfucking nap, you punk ass sucker. Marker place. <laughs> I'ma throw this piece of shit in the dumpster. He ain't got no fucking skills. I'ma put it where he fucking belongs. Complete. Trash ass motherfucker. Trash ass <laughs> nigga. Analysis complete. Got a couple of A plus plus suckers. Kidnap them. I swear I'm dumping this suck in this goddamn dumpster. I want to do it so badly. Damn, I think I fucked myself here. Oh well. He's coming too. Roger that. I probably could have went around, but let's just keep it. Let's just keep it moving. Did this boy just wave? Analysis complete. This boy drove past and he waved at him. Got to see your friend, you punk bitch. You happy? You're not making me happy. You're moving your goddamn head the entire time, making me waste bullets and being nosy. Just take your nap. Uh oh, somebody from this goddamn left hand side saw him fall down. You ain't see nothing. Right in your leg. You take your nap. You ain't see nothing either. Why are these boys so damn nosy? Nap time, motherfucker. It's hard to see his face at night. There we go, we got him. And you can see through my whack Analysis game that I really miss Quiet's influence on me. Analysis I wish I had her around just in the background able to snipe some suckers when I'm missing 83 goddamn times. Complete. Analysis complete. Ooh. I know you're supposed to get in that truck, but your skills you too goddamn high, sucker. What the f what the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? You're gross! Take your nap! Fucking nasty. Subject on board. Leave the rest to us. Development complete. 
I didn't even see this dude. Where the fuck did you come from, sucker? Did he just... Am I really that fucking blind? <laughs> I think I really am that blind sometimes. Didi had already spotted him. And I literally walked right into him. I don't know if I'm blind or fucking stupid. Might be a combination of the two. Alright, so it looks like the area around this prisoner is clear. Analysis complete. You are that's my little motherfucker, ain't you? Help me! Analysis complete. We're gonna get you out of here, girl. Caution. Silent storm approaching. Analysis complete. Plus, plus. Take this little S rank motherfucker. Alright. Let's grab this punk sucker here. Who's asking if somebody's alright? Why are you so goddamn nosy? Analysis complete. You gotta extract him. See some of y'all got some skills. Analysis complete. Everybody here is A plus plus. That means y'all coming with me. Subject on board. Leave the rest to us. Analysis complete. Woo! Boy lying his last off, but he got some skills, I bet. See right here for a second, girl. I want to send this motherfucker for a ride. Support helicopter Roger. requested. Even if he's not an S plus rank, he might just be an S rank, so he still might be somebody good to have in the unit. Even though he's a lion, some of them a bitch. All right, let's get this girl up out of here. Roger that. All right, so I called the goddamn helicopter because I know you get more heroism points for putting prisoners onto the helicopter, extracting them that way. So that's the goal here. Actually, now that I think about it, yeah, we are at maximum capacity, so let me just make sure that this new chick that comes in has a space. Get rid of a bum. She might have replaced the bum anyway, but you don't want to go through all of the trouble of infiltrating an entire enemy base. And then she just get dismissed because her skills might not be high enough. She is an A plus rank though. My girl Silent Wallaby is super skilled with her infiltration, but her speed just she ain't got them hot feet like Punish Snake does. Alright, so I was concentrating on Pequod leaving. I didn't really... Yeah, so you get the increase in the heroism for extracting the prisoner on top of the helicopter. And then that was the heroism for completing the mission. But you get more. I think you get like 60 for extracting the Fulton and then you get double 
for extracting. 120 is double at 60, of course. You get 120 or double for extracting using the helicopter. It costs a little bit more GMP, but it helps the heroism. GMP is a fairly easy commodity, and my helicopter deployment costs aren't that high, so I think I like that trade-off of extracting the prisoner that way. And it gives off a little bit of a Ground zero z vibe when Big Boss wasn't a piece of shit and he actually helped prisoners escape terrible situations. We got some puppies. Didi, you want to handle this shit? You got a knife, that's right. Don't be peeking at me, motherfucker. My boy D, y'all peeking hard. Y'all peeking way too hard. Get him. Didi, they playing too hard, Didi. Oh, bastard! Get your punk ass up off me. Oh, so Didi doesn't kill the puppies. I can sick Didi on these motherfuckers any day. All right then. Thanks for having my back, boy. Okay. Oh. Alright, so like I said, we're gonna finish this off with the infiltration of OKB Zero to get this highly skilled soldier. We're a little low on bullets and suppressor, but... I don't think you can replenish in the base. I don't think the base has any suppressor spots. I should have stole a vehicle. This girl definitely doesn't run fast enough for me to just be sprinting through the desert. I would turn on some music, but I don't want, I don't want my channel to get shot down by fucking YouTube, but I'm just gonna get our sprint on. A little midnight jog through the Afghanistan deserts. Alright, here we go. So I've been here before, because usually there's containers that I can extract on. But we're worried about extracting after we finish the base. mission in OKB-0. Where the fuck did that throw that grenade at? I'm glad Didi was there to kind of distract this dude, because he was about to get towed up with that damn assault rifle I got. My boy was running up too hard. You, Analysis complete. you can take your nap, punk ass sucker. You can take your nap. Let's grab this emplacement before we uh, use the vehicle to further infiltrate OKB Zero. Probably gonna need to call him for some supplies to be honest with you. Because my suppressor is about to run out. And so are my bullets. I think we should be good. Extraction arrived at another base. Do you want to handle these motherfuckers again? Boss, get down. The enemy sniper. Stay low and crawl along the ground. That should enable you to sneak past enemies. Enemy presence detected. The map has been updated. Attack! Not really kill, but just knock him the fuck out. I don't like him running around behind me while I'm trying to take out this punk ass sniper. You ain't see nothing, bitch. And there goes my suppressor. Go. All 
All right, so let's get these puppies up out of here. That guy radioed in and then he fell asleep. So now the entire base is on alert. But these guys are none the wiser to my presence, so I think we're still good. Why is he stunned? Did he fall off the fucking platform? What the hell happened there? That motherfucker like Peyton goddamn Manning. What happened to that guy? Did he get blown up on a fucking claymore? What happened? Did he get blown up on a fucking claim? What? To that boy that was running down that way. What the fuck happened to him? He was he was in my sight, then he just fucking disappeared completely. He's coming too. Roger that. I thought I heard an explosion too. going to use the decoy to lure the guy that was running away Analysis back. Complete. That motherfucker just got... What the... F Did he get blown up? I swore he got blown up. Don't really want to use the... Whatchamacallit. The snipe rifle. If I got too many people around me, I can use it to take one guy out. It should lure the rest of the guys Analysis in the base complete. outwards. and that's the target that I need to extract. Analysis complete. Some of these dudes are just B rank bump status motherfuckers. Don't need them. Just get your ass back down. I'll leave them alive for right now. But if things get hairy, you know they're gonna get fucked up with this goddamn assault rifle grenade launcher combo I got going. And as long as I don't get caught, they'll just be neutralized by being held up, so I'll leave them there. And the good suckers, I will steal. And the goodies, I will steal as well. Alright, so it looks like the containers have spawned. So we got a way out. Don't call your mama. Don't tell nobody nothing. Shut your bitch ass up. It's not the greatest thing to be unsuppressed, but the hope is that it'll draw some of these suckers away from the area where they're all fucking congregated. Oh, no bueno! Where did you see me from? Why are your eyes so good? Take your nap, you slut! Shit. 
he and everybody else in this base should be glad that he took that trank bullet to the motherfucking face because it could have been a whole lot worse. It could have been a whole hell of a lot worse, baby. A motherfucker's just disappearing. Where did that guy go? What the fuck? You gotta extract him. Analysis complete. Am I losing my fucking mind here? I know I'm gonna rewatch this goddamn replay. And I probably ran to extract the second guy and ran past the first guy thinking that the thinking that I extracted the first guy and the second guy disappeared. Sometimes I'm thinking about the infiltration and steps way ahead of what I'm actually doing and I just get lost. And shit just fucks me up sometimes. Oh, I was just about to snipe you in the face. Why did you move? Look this way, you piece of shit. It's a good thing I was hidden by this little ledge so I didn't get a reflex mode by somebody seeing me off on the side. But it doesn't look like they're moving from this little area here. What you peeking at, motherfucker? You want a stun grenade surprise? I got it for you, baby. I'm just chucking these bitches now. They all ran up here. What the fuck is this? What's going on with this little analysis complete? What the fuck is here? Do with the skills is running like a bitch. Stun grenades are no motherfucking joke. Silent Wildby's arm is no motherfucking joke. <laughs> She's hitting these motherfuckers from deep. Hands up. Analysis complete. I'll take your bitch ass. Should bank off the wall and get the target. Analysis complete. We'll save his nosy ass because he had some decent Analysis skills. Complete. This motherfucker here can take his nap. Hands up. You're gonna extract Analysis complete. You can get your kidnapping, bitch. Analysis complete. Analysis I like how they got the audacity to finish a search. Analysis even though I've just been blowing shit up for like the last 30 minutes in this funky ass base. He's coming too. Roger that. Like I said before, I'm just holding these dudes up so they can remain neutralized. They'll probably wake up from the stun grenade or the sleep grenades or the tranks eventually. Detected. Before I extract out of this area, and I don't want that happening. Analysis complete. He ain't the highest skilled motherfucker, but I'll take him. Detected. The map has been updated. Side on completed. 
subject on board. Extraction arrived the rest to us. another base. Analysis complete. Development project has been added. Just like I said, this motherfucker woke back up when he wasn't ready. Sit your ass back down, motherfucker. Stop peeking at me, you hoe. You got some skills, bitch? Analysis complete. It's your happy ass peeking at me. Like I'm your goddamn friend. Silent Wallaby ain't your motherfucking friend. Enemy presence detected. The map has been updated. Alright, so we're not gonna have enough to get all the containers out of this area. And maybe if there are some extra good level soldiers, I'm not gonna have enough Fultons. I was thinking about calling in for some, but it depends. It depends on how many of these guys got some decent skills. I know there's three containers in this area, three red containers with a whole lot of materials. You know what, fuck, I'm calling it in. I'll call them for some more Fultons. I want all these materials, I want all these fucking emplacements, I want it all. Supplies requested. Supply drop complete. <laughs> I love this game. I fucking love this game. Give me my supplies and take a sucker out at the same time, baby. Nap time. Can you all go? <laughs> Extraction. <laughs> This game's great. Let me get my motherfucking supplies before they start stealing my shit. You know these motherfuckers don't know how to act. That boy is sprinting to steal my shit. I swore I equipped a fucking decoy. <laughs> that was an accident. I didn't even see if he had any skills or not. That boy got fucked up. I didn't even mean to be a demon right there and blow his motherfucking ball sack off. That was an accident. Analysis complete. That boy is probably an S plus plus ranking shit. Complete. Subject on board. Leave the rest to us. <laughs> hell of a way to hell of a way to secure the outpost. Analysis complete. All right, so he ain't got no goddamn skills, and I want him to wake up. And then just find everybody either unconscious or held up. I want this little calling card to be left to you. <laughs> actually, actually. <laughs> Let me put this ugly motherfucker exactly where he belongs and shit. Let me put him exactly where he belongs with his raggedy bitch ass. You ain't shit. Alright, so I already got the biological materials in that building. The only thing left for me to do is to get the hell up out of here. The side up is complete. The suckers have been blown up. And the area has been secure. Let's head back to Mother Base. Extraction arrived at Mother Base. Alright, so this has been a Silent Wallaby heavy part, and it probably will be going forward. We got some awards and a database entry. Let's clear this out before we finish this little part off here. Silent Wallaby definitely did her goddamn thing, though. Alright, so we've mastered the art of Fulton Extraction, also known as being a thieving motherfucker. 
But we got the F Ballista D Walker armament available for deployment. Not deployment, but development. I don't know why the fuck I read deployment, but I gotta start using D Walker. That's a that's a buddy I haven't used this entire game. There's a lot of things I haven't done this entire game, but as we mix it up right here with the player character, my girl Stanley Wildby, and some other members of the combat unit, you know, I'll be using D Horse a little bit more often, and I'll be trying to use D Walker a little bit more often as well. But it's hard. It's hard not to play this. It's hard to play this game. And I use this hands, motherfucker, right here. It's adorable, son of a bitch, right here. Yeah, yeah, that's right. I'm talking about you, you adorable little bastard. I'm talking about you, you handsome motherfucker. I love you, Dee Dee. But uh, let's claim these. Let's claim these rewards right here. My internet is so shitty, I get kicked offline every 12 minutes. So I got some GMP in the bank, and a whole lot of development finished while we were in the Please base camp. But there's nothing I can really do about it right now so I, like I said that's a good place for me to call it an end we've been taking care of a lot of side out but like I said we are in the post story mode the portion of this walkthrough we got a whole lot of mission there's missions that I haven't done well all these missions I've done but there's replay missions with variants the extreme variants total stealth variants that I need to complete there's also the missions I have already completed that I need to go back get S ranks on complete objectives there are obtainable skills and blueprints that I need the cybernetics specialists and drug developers and the backup back down mission like I, there's a whole lot of things I need to do in this game so the walkthrough is far 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 from done this walkthrough the Peace Walker walkthrough there's a whole lot of metal motherfucking gear solid and y'all that's gonna be coming so prepare your booty holes for that but as of right now ladies and gentlemen that's the end of this part i hope you all enjoyed the video if you did and you want to see more make sure you hit the like button make sure you share the video out and if you're not already subscribed to the channel hit the subscribe button i will see y'all in the next one